Hey guys, and welcome back to the Tutorial Millennial channel. In this video, I am going to be showing you how to create a sound wave effect in Illustrator. So I'm just going to um, click on the, the line segment tool, and I'm just going to create a line. And I am just going to actually make it a shorter and make the stroke a bit bigger. Let's just make it shorter. And I'm just going to press Ctrl C and Shift Ctrl V and pressing the shift and the right arrow key. I'm just going to drag it around this much. And I'm just going to now go to object. Um, blend and make. So again, go to object, blend, and blend options. And for specified steps, just choose um, around this much or maybe even more, maybe around 20. And I'm just going to press OK. Now I'm just going to select this and I'm just going to go to object. Um, envelope distort and make with mesh and I want the columns to be 20 and the rows too and now I'm just going to select these things and just make it bigger with the selection direct selection tool I can either make it longer or shorter so and how you do it is totally up to you. Oops. And I'm just going to do that for all of this, so I'll be right back with you when I'm done. Okay, and I am back and I have now created this sort of sound wave and I'm just going to press control C and shift control oh hold on I sorry I need a control C and then shift control V and then I'm just going to put it down here for um, I'm just going to be showing you how to create this other um, sound wave but for this one I'm just going to click object and then expand and then press OK and for the stroke I want the cap to be rounded and you have this really cool sound wave effect and for this one I want to just go to um, click on it and I'm just going to click and make the weight smaller around one and I am just going to click on it again and if I rotate it it'll create this really cool sound wave effect so let's so just rotate it around 90 degrees on your laptop and this will create you'll create this really cool effect and I'm just going to go to object and press expand and from here you can color it into this really cool gradient. So I'm just going to, oops, wrong. It has to be the outline, sorry, my bad. Don't forget to click on the outline part and just select gradient and you can change the colors here. As you can see, oops. So I'm just going to choose a sort of pink selection for my gradient. Um, make this lighter. Add another pink color. I might just delete these. And just make, oops, get into three. This is, oops, <laughs> this is obviously up to you what color you want to use. Okay. 
Also, you can add a gradient to this one too. I prefer it like this. And that is basically how you can create a sound wave effect in Adobe Illustrator. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and also subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section down below, and I will try my best to answer them all. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!